I don't know what will blow your mind if this doesn't blow your mind that you can absolutely get these cards for dirt cheap. If you guys are interested in buying mutt coins, go to my sponsor, use code DOG for a 5% discount on checkout. What's good, YouTube? How y'all doing, man? Welcome to a brand new video, man. Today I'm finna show y'all a banger, man. The absolute banger. You can definitely get Cam Newton for free. No, this is not no clickbait. Watch the whole video. Stay tuned. It's gonna take a while. It depends on how you look at it. You can get Cam Newton for free or you can get Cam Newton for very cheap. So the first thing you wanna do is you wanna find the cheapest 94. I like to do the 94s because the 94s are super cheap. It's very low risk because you're only spending 46K, 45K. Y'all just see me snag that one for 46K. Price range I would say is anything below 40. I, I would say anything below 50, honestly, depending on how the prices is. Now it does require a little luck, but for the most part, it's not really lucky because even if you guys are doing this for super cheap, you're still going to be making profit or you're going to be getting a Cam Newton car on the back end really, really, really cheap. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to get that car. You're going to quick sell them for training. Now you want to hit these theme diamond two set pieces. Now we didn't, we talk about theme diamond two set pieces because they're so fire. There's so many ways you guys can make coins with this method. It's absolutely ridiculous. I promise you. It is ridiculous how many coins you can make with this method. And every time there is a new way to make coins, every single promo, there's going to be a new way. It just depends on how you want to look at it. Now, I'm going to show you all how to get this Cam Newton for super cheap. It will take a while, but you can get it done. So every single reroll, keep track of how many coins you're spending, and then you'll understand what you have put into the set. Some sets you may make a lot of coins. Some sets you may make 2K. It really just depends on how much you're getting that 94 for. If you guys want to, you can go ahead and buy 95s, 96s, whatever you want to do. The reason why I do 94s is because I'm only spending 45K, which means if I'm spending 45K, I only got to make back 45K. See the cars that we got. We only got to make back 40K. Even if we don't make back 40, 46K, it's okay. Because whatever we're doing, we're going to put it towards Cam Newton's set. Now, for the first the first way you want to do this, right, is you want to calculate how much everything is going for. In this reroll, a lot of these cars are going to get kept, mainly because we're going to put these towards the set. But the cars that we will be selling is Marcus Peters, which is going for about 12K. Jared Goff is going for about 4K, so that makes 16. He's going for about 9K, so that makes 25K. So remember, we spent 46K, so we got to subtract our, we got to put back in our 25K because that's how much we spent. So now we left with around 21K, right? So we got 21K into the set. Now, obviously, these cars right here are such low overalls, right? Very low overalls, 84s. So we're just going to go ahead and chalk those to the set. So technically, we're negative 21K right now. But every time you do this method with the 94s, you guys are going to get 10 and a half pulls. So our next reroll, instead of us pulling 10, we're going to be able to pull 11 because we have extra training. So remember that. So on this reroll, if we were to do another reroll, we would just add our negative to the next set. So now how to get the Cam Newton now that we are in 21K. So now Cam Newton has cost us 21K right now. So you want to go to this NFL draft, right? You want to go to the draft picks all the way at the bottom you get 121 through 32 draft pick which is 86 overall for exchanging 183 and 380 through 82s right so what we did is we're going to put our 182 in i mean our 184 in right which is going to be this guy right here i'm not going to even try and say his name this guy and then we we put our 82 in also that we just got kevin and we got anthony hitchens so we could add these two to the set and now we one card away from our first card into Cam Newton. So every time you get this 86, right, you're going to get 186. You're going to need four 86s to get 190, right? So you're going to need three 90s to get 193, which you're going to keep upgrading. So you're, now you're going to go back again. Once you get your 90, you're going to go back again and you got to go do that two more times. So then you have two 90s absolutely free or very low cost. And you want to keep upgrading this all the way up until you get to your Cam Newton, right? You essentially doing this for absolutely free, but it's just going to take you some time. I would say if you guys did this all day, well, like one day, you can get it done in one day, but it also depends on your pool. So now you guys understand what you need to do. Take the 83s to 84s and take the 80 to 82s. Those are the only cards you're going to need. You're going to sell everything else. Now we put our cards in the set. This is what you guys can do. We could keep golden tape for our next three rerolls. So now we have three 84s already taken care of because we pulled so many in this reroll, right? 
So now we gotta go back again and get another 94. Now let's look at our cards because we are negative 21K, but you guys see pulling 11 cards got us straight. So basically these cards right here, I'm gonna go ahead and put these up for like 1 million coins, right? So at this point, we first have to pay for our second card, which was 48K. We got a, we got some solid pools to pay for our second car. So Lamar Miller is gonna pay for, for a lot of it. So let's add this up. So after adding all of these up, we get 58K. Cost us 48K for this car, right? And we were already negative 21K from our last set. So now the point of selling these cars, we are now in Cam Newton for 11K. We have now only spent 11K on Cam, Cam Newton once we sell all the cards we don't need to put into the set. So at this point, what you would do is you would add him to the set, right? So now you add him to the draft pick because he's going into the set. So now we're getting our second draft pick. So now we are in a good place. We now have two draft picks that we're gonna pick up the same 86 overall. We now have two draft picks for 11K. Now we could sell these cards if we wanted to, but obviously we're not. Keep in mind that we have 11K, but we still have these cards, all of these cards right here. I'm about to show you all of these cards right here that I just marked for quick sale. All of these cards are cards that are now ours. Let's put this, let's let's go ahead and let's go ahead and put this Darnell Savage into the set so we can get rid of this. So he's going into the 11 through 20. We would only need one more to get a 90 overall. I mean, obviously, I think we got we got a 90 overall for something else, but because we have one in there input already. But we would only need one more to get a 90 overall, right? So with that being said, is we now have 286 overalls right for 11k because everything we've done so far means that we're only in 11k on the set so now as we keep going doing this over and over and over again you see what good pulls can do to you i literally took 46k turned it into 58k but because i was negative from the previous re-rolls we have to average that out which now makes us 11k so now we are negative 11k at this point but as we keep going on, we'll get better rerolls, we'll get worse rerolls. But for the most part, you guys can complete this Cam Newton set for absolutely free. All you're doing is rerolling cars to get the car for the set. You keep upgrading and you keep going higher and higher and higher and higher and higher. Once you make your first 98, you do the same process over again. You make your second 98, you put it in the Cam Newton set, and now you have a 99 overall Cam Newton for absolutely no coins if this doesn't blow your mind i don't know what will man i don't know what will blow your mind if this doesn't blow your mind that you can absolutely get these cards for dirt cheap even if you guys are only into the set for 100k think about that only into a set for a 99 overall quarterback for 100k that you could put on the auction block right now for 300 get back 270 make 160k by just re-rolling cards you see you guys could do this faster you could do this slower if you wanted to, you could do the 95s because you get it. You do the 95s, you get 25k training, and then you'll be able to reroll more cars at one time. I like to do the 94s because it's safe. The 94s are safe than right. If you even want to go safer than that, do 93s. The only thing you need to upgrade in these sets is 83s and 84s, 80 through 82s. That is it. Everything else you put on the auction block, you quick sell, and it's literally that simple. Sometimes you could think about it like this: if you have, like, let's just say I spent. 46k on this but i wanted to just re-roll it I, I didn't care about the 46k i wanted to just quick sell all the cars that i got right so i just i just want to take everything that's not an 83 84 and then i think that's it and i wanted to take the 17k training i could do that realistically i could do that or if i said hey you know what i don't need these 84s for right now actually let's just do this yeah i don't need these 84s for right now so i'll just quick sell this Think about how much training you spent on initial 94. You spent 18,200 training on the initial 94. Now that I quick sell the cars that I don't need, I now get back 19,000 training, which means I made 800 training on that set, plus the cards that I got like David Moore, Shelby Harris, which go into the later on sets. I still have Golden Tate. I still have Chandler Jones. I still have Desmond King. I'm still holding on to these cars for later sets. They not, they haven't costed me anything. 
Or if you want to look at it through a different way, I could sell all these cards and say, all right, so I'm going to just sell my Joe Thune, my David Moore, my Shelby Harris, and I'm going to break even. And then I'm going to start back over at zero, but I still got my 286s. It just depends on how you want to look at it, man. There's multiple ways you can get the set done, but if you do it right, it'll be free. If you do it wrong, it'll still be only 100K. There is no, there is no losing in the situation as long as you don't OD on the cards and spend 60K per 94 and you're only making averaging like 40K back. Then you're going to lose a lot of coins. But if you stay in that 40 to about 45, 46K range, and then with the 95s, if you stay in that 50 to about 58k range the sky's the limit bro i hope you guys enjoyed this video man if you guys don't subscribe from this video i don't think you're going to subscribe to any video so with that being said i hope you guys subscribe and i'm gonna see you on the next video i'm out peace